So we have in place here something called a circuit breaker in order to break the chain of disease and um, I must say that there are still people on the streets. Uh, there are people like myself who have to get out to get things done. Uh, errands run. We still have to go to work. I wish honestly that I could just stay home for the whole month and you know, hide away from the population. But I can't. I still got to earn a living. And I'm currently at the laundromat. Um, this is one of the few places I know of around my area that has hot water facilities so I can sanitize my clothing. My daughter and I, you see, we work in pretty high-risk professions. She, she deals with an international crowd. I deal with rubbish and, you know, we stand a very much higher chance than anyone of coming in contact with um, any passerby who's asymptomatic and we might just get it. I mean, COVID is in the air everywhere now. I, I'm terrified. I, I can confess to you I'm terrified. I only hope that if, an, if anything were fated to happen, please don't let it happen to my two kids. I mean, they're grown children, but it's my flesh and blood, and I, I worry that they will get it. But I, I'm resigned to the fact that at some point, either she, myself, or whatever, we, we may run into someone who's had it. We may know someone who has actually been quarantined for it. So, yeah, I mean, with certain precautions in place, we're still trying to carry our lives on as normal, as, as normally as possible. Uh, I am a service crew. I work for the restaurant. Um, you know, I, I work for a restaurant, and uh, we are one of the people that clean up the place after the crowd has left. Now, currently, we are focusing only on takeout uh, delivery. So after the restaurant closes formally, um, people like myself and my colleagues will be cleaning and sanitizing everything in the store. That's the nature of my work. We are considered essential services. Um, I can tell you honestly that there are days where I'm terrified of what I have to pick up. You know, uh, when you are carrying rubbish, for example, no amount of masks and gloves will protect your clothing because you will definitely come in contact with something. So we try our very best to provide a safe, um, you know, environment for customers to come in and take their food out. But please, I, I would just ask the general population to please be mindful of your public hygiene. Throw your stuff away in the proper places. Don't throw your masks on the road. Um, don't throw your used tissues on the floor for us to pick up. Because any as staff, we would also have a right to, how do you put it, protect ourselves. And if you please, if you you know, if you throw up some place in a restaurant, for example, you know, please inform the staff. We have a right to protect ourselves before we approach the area for a cleanup. I've had people just throw up and they don't even bother to inform me, and they disappear. And you walk, you can, you can be patrolling, and you walk almost smack into a pile of vomit. But thankfully, for now, uh, dine in has closed, and uh, uh, one load off us for the time for the time being. Uh, Wherever you are in the world, I wish you well and I hope that you're keeping safe. Take care. God bless you.